हेलो एवरी वन माय नेम इज सानिका एंड आई वेलकम यू टू दी यूट्यूब चैनल इन टूडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी हाउ टू क्रिएट दी मल्टीलिंगल एप्लीकेशन इन पावर एप्स सो इन दिस वीडियो आई विल वॉक यू थ्रू हाउ यू कैन मेक यूअर पावर एप्स यूजर इंटरफेस स्विच सिमलेसली बिटवीन लैंग्वेजेस लाइक इंग्लिश हिंदी एंड मराठी और एनी अदर लैंग्वेज यू वॉन्ट सो विथआउट वेस्टिंग टाइम Let's get started for the video. So here I have created the student information application. When I click on this uh, drop down and uh, I will change the language. So in Hindi we can see the information in Hindi and in Marathi we can see the information in Marathi. So likewise we can create the application multilingual. the first step to create the application multilingual we need to add the new component here so i am adding the component and uh, in component there is a option of new custom property in the right hand side so i click on that uh, new custom property option here i am changing the display name i am giving the display name as a language then display name and name will be same then i am adding the description i want to make the application multilingual we can add the any description that we want then uh, property type data property definition input and uh, data type uh, i am selecting the text and then uh, raise on reset when value changes i am clicking on that check box then create here in the custom property we can see the language uh, that we have added the custom property after that i am adding the new custom property for the output purpose here i am giving the name as uh, labels then uh, display name and name is same then uh, description here i am giving the description as a translated label then uh, property type data property definition i am giving as a output uh, data type i am selecting the record and create after that on the components on reset property i have created the variable that is where translation then i have created the table for creating the application multilingual uh, here i am using the english hindi and marathi language for english language we are using the en and uh, for hindi language we are using the hi and uh, for marathi we are using the mr on the home screen of the app there is a section of student classes and grades so here i am using that uh, words uh, in english i have given the words in english like student classes and grades and in hindi i am giving the meaning of the student classes and grades in hindi likewise for the marathi language in the same way we can add all the meanings of the word in hindi english and marathi on the on reset property of the component after that on the components label property here i am commenting the first code and here i am using the code that is look up where translation language equal to lower coles self dot language comma language dot label this formula fetches the translated label based on the user selected or device default language it looks up the correct language row from the where translation collection and return its label after that on the home screen of the application here i have added the drop down and on the items property of the drop down i have given the english hindi and marathi then we need to put the formula 
on the unchanged property of the drop down here on the unchanged property of the drop down here i have used the nested if condition if drop down multilingual dot selected dot value equal to english then set var language to english otherwise set var language to hindi or marathi after adding drop down we have to add the component so component 1 we have created so i am going to the home screen and here i am inserting that component 1 on the home screen so we have added that component on the home screen of the app then on the components language property i am giving the variable name that is var language after that uh, we need to change the label of each section here on the text property of the student section here i am giving the reference of component similarly we can do for all the after that uh, we need to change the label of each section here on the text property of the section i am giving the reference of component here i am using the component one of one dot labels dot student then for the next section here i am giving the reference of component to make the application multilingual dot labels dot classes for the third section here on the text property i am writing component 1 of 1 dot labels dot grades similarly we can do for all the labels in the app here we gave the name that is component 1 of 1 that uh, we have added on the home screen previously this is the component 1 of 1 that uh, we have added on the home screen and uh, we are giving the reference of that component here i have changed the text property of each label and after that i go to the play mode and changing the drop down value we can see that our uh, language is changing from english to hindi then again i am going to the drop down and changing the value then we can see our application language is changing in marathi language in this way we can create the multilingual application in power apps that's all about today's video thank you for watching the video please subscribe the channel and if you have any question please put it in comment box Thank you